Hi friends, in this video, we will plan morphology. So, this is the 7th standard science book. So, in this unit, we will see part 1, part 2, part 2, part 2, part 2, part 2, root system. So, part 2 is root system. So, part 1 is root system. So, part 1 is root system. So, plant morphology. Morphology is how the plant is like this. How is it like this? 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 That is described in the unit. So, first, characteristics of living things. So, we know how to live in the living things. How to live in the living things. So, we have some examples. Living things, plants, animals. Non-living things, rock, book, etc. That is all. So next to parangga, semua living things ke, enak na adi padia na vision pati na, aduk sahpad weno. Adem ni anda sahpad convert panne, enak wa convert panada, energy convert panade. So, satu satu stage rukum pati na, growing stage, satu satu stages of life, adu sol rangga. Respond to the surroundings, awun le sutro surul ke, eh, temar ya adu walar de, adu habitat sol lah. So, adu ber adu dia life span time, adu dia evlo nala adu walar de, adu kuri kerangga. So, reproduce their own kind, ini ina perikat kuri kide. So, semua wiran me, eda la made panade pati na, anik la la made panada, so adu dia mandi made up of cells. So next பாருங்க habitate various habitats of plants So இது எதைக் குறிக்குதுனா வாழ்விடத்து பத்திதான் குறிக்குது எல்லா செடிமே வந்து வெரும் மண்ணில மட்டும் எல்லா தன்னில இருக்கு, desertல இருக்கு, hillsல இருக்கு அது எல்லாம் இது குறிக்குது So next பாருங்க Yugan warming to a person என்ன பண்ணிருக்கார்னா 1909 First, hydrophytes, second, mesophytes, third, xerophytes. So, first, hydrophytes. Hydro is water, phytes is plants. So, what is it? It is the water in the water. So, what do you think? What do you think of the plants? Water of ponds, lakes, rivers, kutta, yeri, or other plants. So, what do you think of hydrophytes? So, this is the hydrophytes three types of hydrophytes. First type is free floating hydrophytes. That is the same as the same as the same as the same. These plants float freely on the water surface. That is an example of water hitchant. That is the same as the same as the same. So, free floating hydrophytes are all the same as 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 the same. So next type is attached floating hydrophytes. That is how it is fixed. The bottom is fixed. The pond is fixed. The leaves are fixed. The surface of the water is fixed. So the best example is water lily or alli, lotus. So this is how it is fixed. Next type is the water lily. The water lily is fixed. The water lily is fixed. The water lily is fixed. So next type is the submerged hydrophytes. Submerged is fixed. The plant 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 is fixed. So, the root is fixed in the mud and remains under the water. That's why we have to say that these plants are rooted in the mud and remain under water. For example, we have to say that the plant is fixed in the mud and remains under water. So, the plant is fixed in the mud and remains under water. So, next is the adaptations of hydrophytes. So, let's say that the hydrophytes are equal to the hydrophytes. So, the hydrophytes are equal to the hydrophytes. अरे ये ना सुलगा रूट सिस्टम वंदे ऐप्पली इतना पोवरा आ रखूँ सुलगा ये देख लाना रूट्स युरुद्ध नहीं चुना आधे गला वंदे रंबा पोवरा आ रखूँ सुलगा अपरं पारणा आदरे इन सम केसेस रूट्स आर इवन एब्सन इधर वंदे ये देख सुलगा फ्री फ्लोटिंग हाइड्रोफाइट्स पाती ना रूट्स एक कड़े आदे सा � आदि एप्पली को आदमी ना स्पॉन्ज़ यार को निंगे वंदे पात्री पिंगला लोटस उड़िया पूत और मोड़ पात्री पिंगला ना स्ट्रेम में एप्पली को ना पाक का तो नाला तिक्का वो शाट्टा वर नाले में आना आदि कुल्ला यंदे स्पॉन्ज़ यार को आदि एल्ला में ये दाल आना दे पाती ना विद एयर स्पेसेस सो ये दिकागना � so next is leaves. We have to look at the leaves like this. So what is the reason? The leaves are in the waxy coat. So what is the reason? The leaves are in the waxy coat. So what is the reason? The leaves are in the waxy coat. So what is the reason? The leaves are in the waxy coat. So next is the mesophytes. Where are the mesophytes plants? Where is the mesophytes plants? Where is the mesophytes plants? Where is the water supply? 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 So what is the crop? Where is the crop? Where is the mesophytes plants? So, for example, wheat, maize, sunflower, mango, neem, etc. So, next is adaptation of mesophytes. Mesophytes are the same. This is the root that is developed. So, well-developed root. The leaves are larger and broader. 
So next paranga is xerophytes. Xerona desert fights na plants. So in the plant when the inga varun padina dry areas are varu. So desert pahudile the varu thala. This pair is na xerophytes. So in the plant la padina yelli yella enna varuna mulla mariru. So in the plant body padina. Yedu mari arathle erkam padina water scarcity. Tanni romba illa the arathle eriko. Romba adig maan a temperature ke arathle eriko. Romba strong a na winds arathle erikon solranga. So example when the open shea chapati kali da solranga. The picture la kudtri kang paranga. So, that is adaptation, adaptation of xerophytes. So, this is a very long route. And the route is very long. So, this is very long. This is very long. So, most of the water is very long. So, this is very long. So, this is very long. So, this is very so next paarenga stem da inda edathla enna padana photosynthesis pannudhu adu eppadi irukum paathina romba thickavum flat avum irukum so photosynthesis ala adu eppadi irukum paathina green color la irukudhu so next paarenga leaves la chapathi kal la mull irukum paathinga and the mull da vandu leaves so leaves vandu eppadi modify aayiruchu nu paathina mulla maaruchu adhu da spines so edukagam paathina loss of water vandu prevent pandradhukku and the chedi la iruka daavarathla iruka thanni vandu veliyarama irukkaradhukaga indha idhu vandu eppadi maaruchu leaves vandu eppadi maaruchu paathina mulla maaruchu so next paarenga herbs herbs ellame vandu chedi da kurikkaranga so small plants with the soft and green stems da vandu enadhu herbs adukku nu paathina woody plants kadaiyadhu adhaadhu marakattaiyalaana stem kadaiyadhu so adhu da non woody plants and do not grow more than 1 meter in height oru meter ku alavukku mele adhu enna pannadhu valaradhu adukana example paarenga radish wheat paddy sunflower so idellame vandu herbs oru example so next paarenga shrubs shrubs ellame vandu medium size plants da in the plants pathina paakradhukku thinna irundhalume adu de stem irukku illaya adu vandu eppadi irukku na hard ah um woody ah um irukku so idhukku nu or clear ana main stem kadaiyadhu adhe mari pathina adhukku nariya branches pogudhu branch ah um irukku illa na bushy ah um irukku adukana example paarenga rose jasmine croton tulasi lemon so andha chediya vechi neenga imagine panni paarenga na sonna da correct ah irukku illa so next paarenga trees நமக்கு தெரியும் ட்ரீஸ் எப்படி இருக்கும் ரொம்ப டாலாகவும் பெருசாகவும் இருக்கும் ஸோ டால் அண்ட் பிக் பிளான்ஸ் அதோடைய ஸ்டெம் எப்படி இருக்கும் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா ரொம்ப ஹார்டாகவும் இருக்கும் வுட்டியாகவும் இருக்கும் ஸோ இதோடைய மெயின் ஸ்டெம் எதை சொல்கிறாங்கன்னா ட்ரங்க்கு ஸோ ட்ரங்க்குன்றது அந்த ஸ்டெம் ஆரம்ப பகுதியில் இருக்குது பார்த்தீங்கன்னா அந்த உடற்பகுதி அதுதான் வந்து ட்ரங்க் ஸோ அதிலிருந்து என்ன ஆகும் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா பிரான்ச்சஸ்ஸு லீவ்ஸ் எல்லாமே பிரித்து வருது ஸோ எக்ஸாம்பிள் பாருங்கள் நீம் மேங்கோ டீக் கோகோனட் பேனியன் ட்ரீ எக்ஸட்ரா So next paarenga plants are the parts of the plants. So first part paarthi na root system, next one the shoot system. So that one the differentiate paarenga irukkaan adha paakkalaam. So differentiate paarenga roots alamme eppdi irukkum paarthi na underground la irukkoon. Adha nala vandhu it is underground part. Shoot system alamme vandhu underground ka mail arukkoon. Adha nala adha alamme vandhu aerial part. So next paarenga roots alamme ulla pohum oodhu adha kaana uru main root irukkoon. Adha lindhu nariya branches divide ayet irukkoon. So, if you divide the roots, you can divide the secondary root or tertiary root. So, next is stem. So, stem is the shoot system. So, stem, branches, leaves. So, that is the flowering plants. So, that is the flowers, fruits, seeds. So, that is the shoot system. So, next is the reproduction part. That is the name of the flower. That is the name of the flower. That is the name of the flower. Flowers, fruits and seeds. So, that is the name of the reproduction. So, what is the name of the root? What is the name of the root? Stem, leaves. So, that is the name of the root. Root, stem, leaves are the name of the vegetative parts. That is the name of the fruits, flowers, seeds are the name of the reproductive parts. So, next is the root systems. So, the root system is how it is growing under the soil. So, the root is how it is growing under the soil. So, the root is how it is growing under the soil. So, how it is growing under the soil. Embryo lalu ni, ada tu seed lalu ni, radikal orang ni kerja, adu variya beliau bandar, adu rootnya form agud. So it usually develops from the radical of the embryo. So adu tu, adu embryo ni, adu seed aku rikide, adu radikal ni, picture lalu paringa, so kira bandar ni, adu tu radikal. Adu lalu ni, beliau bandar adu root. So root sepati ni, kita tahu, adu bandar ni, adu sun lalu pada adu, so it grows away from the sunlight. Chlorophyll kade adu, nodes, internodes kade adu, adu meri leaves, flowers, buds, adu meri kade adu. So, in the root system, there are two types. First, tap root system. Second one, adventitious root system. So, next, tap root system. So, radical of embryo is the root. In this picture, the main color is the dark color. That is the primary root. Or tap root. So, in that tap root, branches are divided by the secondary root. So, in that tap root, they are divided by the branches are divided by the secondary root. So, in that secondary root, they are divided by the tertiary root. 
So, in this tap root system, we have a dicot plant. So, the seed is a dicot. So, that's why we have a tap root system. So, for example, mango, neem, carrot, radish, etc. So, next, we have an adventitious root system. This is the root of the radical root of the tap root. So, the tap root is the second root, the primary root, the tertiary root. This is a cluster of clusters. It is a cluster of clusters. So, it is a uniform size and thin. So, it is called a fibrous root system. So, most of these plants are monocot plants. So, for example, rice, grass, maize, bamboo, etc. So next video there is a continuation shoot sister the pati papu. So thanks for watching this video.